50 years ago, that would be five decades ago, I entered Memphis Teen Challenge. So I was the first one to enter the Teen Challenge program there in Memphis and the first one to graduate. Then went back to alcohol and it went back to drugs of any kind. 50 years ago. Now I still can't get my mind wrapped around that, but that's just the grace of God and that's the way he is. But I wanna say, Teen Challenge is effective because it introduces people to the Lord Jesus Christ. It's not effective because of some stepped system. It's effective because the Holy Spirit is involved. I was uh, at Teen Challenge in the early 80s, late 70s, and we had a coffee house and we had an outreach and it was incredible. I met some of the most wonderful people. And from there, we all traveled to about 70 West Tennessee churches sharing the good news of Christ. In those days, we were called a crisis center and we didn't keep people long term, but people would come into our program and we would keep them for about two weeks and then we would send them off to a residential program. But what I really remember most that had the biggest impact was the old building there on Union Avenue. Uh, that building had a glass door on it and that door stayed unlocked from early in the morning to late at night. And we put a bell on that door so we knew when someone would come in. And I can remember being in the part of the house and hearing that bell ring and you just never knew, especially at night, who was gonna be entering that uh, building through that door. People came to us at the last resort, but they were glad they came to us because people actually got results. In 1992, I was introduced to the Teen Challenge program. While there, I accepted Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. And from then, at that point, my life began to change. From 1990 till 2006 was, you know, my, my time, with, and I saw it really grow. But we got people involved in the banquet and got people involved because of our passion. You know, the Bible says my people perish for lack of vision, and we had vision down here. And this ministry has flourished because of the vision of some of those people in the mid-90s. There's no question about it. And my experience uh, at the Hope House was probably the most impactful uh, part of my journey. Uh, just everything about the processes and the way they do things at the Hope House uh, just prepares you for your reentry into uh, society. On behalf of the beautiful city of Clarksville, we welcome you here. We are so grateful. This is not just a program. This moves people from where they are to their expected and intended future.